Hey, what is going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel, man. You guys know what it is, man. It's your boy, Kevin, man. And so today we got 10 Simpson predictions that could have come true in 2020. So we're going to watch 10 Simpson predictions that came true in 2020. We almost at the end of 2020. Let's see how many that the Simpsons actually came true uh, like in 2020. All right. So anyways, let's get in the video, man. Let's go. The Simpsons somehow have the amazing but scary ability to predict the future. Yep. We've all heard that the Simpsons have predicted Donald Trump becoming president, and they also predicted the virus that would shut down the entire world. The dreaded Osaka flu has hit Springfield with over 300 cases now reported. So what's well, next COVID with 30 flu. plus seasons of content? There are things that are bound to come true in 2020, including some major sports predictions, future technology, and possibly another presidential prediction. Honestly, we hope that some of these Simpsons moments don't come true because, well, they aren't all scary. good. So let's just get right into let's the video. See. Do you want to win a brand new iPhone or a brand new MacBook Pro? Maybe you'd prefer a $500 Amazon gift card. Well, comment the hidden message in this video for a chance to enter to win. Of us predicting what the Simpsons already predicted. Confusing, right? Let's start the video by going over some predictions that have already come true in 2020. One of the very first Simpsons predictions that came true was the Kansas City Chiefs winning the Super Bowl. Let's go back to a season 10 episode. In this freakishly weird episode, Homer and the gang attend the Super Bowl in Miami, where an unnamed team in red wins the Super Bowl. Flash forward to the first week in February of 2020. The chances of them getting this right seems pretty easy, because they just guessed that a team with a red colored jersey would win. But just think about it. Out of all the NFL teams and different colored jerseys, they just happened to pick the correct team? Not only did they somehow predict the color of the winning team, but they also got the Super Bowl location correct. Wow. Miami is often a hotspot for Super Bowl games, but the big game has been played all over the country, including Dallas and New Orleans. The player numbers featured in the locker room scene also match up 41. many of the players on the active Chiefs roster. One number that stood out, number 21, which represents the cornerback on the Chiefs, who had seven tackles and an interception in the big game. The prediction what? is just one of the many sports-based ones the show has featured over the years. I have been trying to figure out how the heck the Simpsons predict literally every major event that has happened. It has to be time travel, right? Right? The Simpsons also might have predicted the coronavirus. Yes, it's true. How the heck would the Simpsons know about this? In 1993, the Simpsons episode March in Chains, Season 4, Episode 21, shows a mysterious virus from Asia invading the town of Springfield. A sick factory employee in Japan sneezes into numerous packages containing juicers that everyone from Springfield ordered. When the Springfield residents open their boxes from Japan, they get their products and a whole lot of germs. The disease called the Osaka flu spreads like wildfire, and the small town must endure a scary pandemic that feels a bit too much like what the world is going through now. Yeah. Honestly, this could have happened scary. with any other sickness, but it's crazy that they even predicted this, and now something so horrible is happening in real life. Please don't tell the supervisor I have the flu. I've been working with a shattered pelvis for three weeks. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow. I do believe Mother, that the creator of the Simpsons does have a time ready. machine, man. I bought you a new juicer. Good luck. Since we are on the topic of health, here are some major medical advancements that are getting closer and closer to becoming reality. In season 23, episode Holidays of the Future Past, we see a pregnant Maggie get treated by an advanced medbot who performs an ultrasound and gives advice. Oh, wow. Since the episode aired, we've seen surgery robots, diagnostic robots, yeah. and medical robots who can fill prescriptions. I know for a fact that everyone watching this video has seen a robot video on Instagram or Twitter. They are pretty scary, right? It Hopefully is. Hopefully they don't take over the world. Anyways, You're advancements well, man. in this technology robots will help everywhere. the treatment of pregnant women. Robots have been on The Simpsons since the show began. One of the earliest was the season 6 episode, Itchy and Scratchy Leg. The crazy robots went haywire, causing massive destruction. Then there's also the 2013 episode where Mr. Burns hires robots to take over the nuclear plant. Well, in 2020, we will see the advancements of robots along with some potential problems. One of the first indicators, the Disney World Avengers Campus previews, have showcased a Spider-Man flying high over guests and performing multiple mid-air moves. Well, it's only a matter of time before the thing goes haywire and lands on the guests. Right? Some companies like Amazon are relying on AI tech even more than before, with major plans for expansion in 2020. Just like the nuclear plant robots, we could see some major glitches or errors. There's one doctor in Japan who is developing a medical robot to conduct ultrasounds in remote locations, so no hospitals are needed. Once the robots get unleashed, it could change the way women are treated while pregnant and help serve people all over the globe. 
I don't want to talk about robots anymore no, since they that's scare, scare me. Bro. But another piece of technology we could see becoming true is a hologram mail. The episode of Bart to the Future not only featured the hologram? infamous Donald Trump prediction, but there's also a small moment where Bart receives a hologram message in the mail. FaceTime technology has already become reality, and looking back, nobody would have thought that FaceTime would ever be possible. Yeah. But now it's 2020, and we're Everyone on the got FaceTime of hologram on your technology. Phones. Glad I was able to get through security. And it's so great oh, that's that cool. they finally moved Comic-Con to the 3 million square foot convention center in Las Vegas. That's no, cool. No, no, Homer, you know it's San Diego. Come on. It's oh, so San Diego must have built 10,000 more hotel rooms and one good restaurant. As well as products like the Real <laughs> Fiction HD3 display, showcasing hologram-like technology. While it's marketed towards businesses, you could own one for your home soon. The visuals will integrate to feature live recordings, and FaceTime will become a hologram time. Imagine just eventually, having a hologram yeah. of your friend just in your room, and you guys are That'd just chilling, cool. talking and I about think that video will come games. True eventually. Pretty cool, honestly. Yeah. Sticking with the episode, Bart to the Future, we have another fun moment featuring Marge and Homer enjoying dinner together. But Marge didn't spend hours preparing a perfect meal. Her and Homie simply suck some tubes in their mouths as they enjoy VR food. So far, half of the scene has become reality. VR sets are everywhere now, from PlayStation Kids to mall displays. You cannot escape the growing trend of VR technology. Imagine eating VR food. Now that would be wild. Somehow yeah, we are actually, actually, actually pretty close to it. There is an art exhibit with a restaurant theme where people wore VR headsets as they went on a food journey experience. And they eat food. They didn't even know what they were eating. Hosted at the James Beard House in New York City, the visuals in the headset showcased a blend of food imagery and visual. The people would get handed the food items and eat them, not knowing exactly what they had until they read a menu card. So one day, we might be eating french fries with our VR on, and we might actually think it's a nice salad. If The Simpsons somehow <laughs> predicted that, then they deserve cool. to be awarded for the best TV show of all time. Like, there really isn't any other show that about Trump, predicted man. anything even close to what The Simpsons have predicted. 2020 is a major election year, and this year's election could give us a major glimpse into the future, seeing how the Simpsons go, have already predicted Trump. Donald Trump's presidential run. We have to imagine they wanted to take another shot in the dark. Well, in 2016, the Treehouse of Horror special featured the Simpsons family shopping for a Christmas tree on Halloween night. Homer was dressed like a robot from the future. He peels back a panel to reveal a political button that reads Ivanka 2028. While we know Ivanka won't be running for president in 2020, we could see the seed set for a run in the future. And it all depends on how the election goes in November. If somehow Donald wow. Trump loses, he could set up one of his children for a run in the future. If Donald Trump does in fact win, then he could want his legacy to live on forever by having one of his children to become president. That would be now, crazy. we don't like talking about politics on this channel, but The Simpsons could be right on with the timing. Yeah, I and think so. And we could so. have a political showdown that pits Kanye West against Ivanka Trump. If The Simpsons predict the first female president, I will personally find the creator of The Simpsons and annoy him by asking if he's a time traveler until he right? tells me the truth. As you know, we've inherited quite a budget crunch from this President Lisa, Trump. I remember this episode. 100 days in office, so many accomplishments, lowered my golf handicap, my Twitter following increased by 700, and finally, <laughs> we can shoot hibernating bears. My boys will love that. So Way back in 2005, <laughs> we got another glimpse into The Simpsons' future with the episode Future Drama Many People Loved a Reference. The hover cars in the story were focused on Homer and Marge's relationship. The episode oh, was a cool. sad one because the couple got divorced because Homer spent all of their savings on an underwater home. While the idea seems crazy back then, Homer's investment may have actually paid off. Underwater homes are slowly becoming the newest vacation destination. Yeah, I heard and by that. the end of 2020, we'll see them everywhere, from tropical destinations to popular tourist spots like Dubai. Take that, Marge. Should have never left Homer, because he's going to be a rich, rich man. That's pretty cool. Multiple companies in Japan have been working on a concept known as the Ocean Spiral. The design is meant to house hundreds of people and provide sustainable living using the ocean's energy and wildlife. So yeah, the next time you find yourself staying in an underwater hotel or putting a down thanks, payment thanks, on an Atlantic Ocean oasis, you have Homer Simpson to thank. Right? Does anyone else think that every year more and more companies are merging together? We have a giant world of Disney incorporating 20th Century Fox, yep. Marvel, Star Wars, yep. Muppets, ABC, Disney's and everywhere. ESPN. Disney's then there's over CBS everything. and Viacom with the Paramount Network, MTV, and Nickelodeon. Only time will tell, but The Simpsons are already on the right track in the Flash Forward episode, Lisa's Wedding. We saw a news report by Kent Brockman, who was reporting for CNN CBS, which was a merger between CNN and NBC and CBS. While these companies will remain separate wow. for the foreseeable future, some streaming giants could acquire companies pretty soon. Rumors have circulated about Lionsgate being sold to a bigger company, 
and set up streaming services like Apple and Roku may acquire their own companies, as well as the major players will only grow and gobble up a bunch of TV channels. In the process, get ready for AMC to become AMC Netflix or some powerhouse right, streaming AMC Netflix. As Disney settles down with their massive Fox purchase, other companies will look to expand their foothold. 2020 is already crazy, and it feels like this year isn't even real. But one thing that we all know now yeah, every, I is I think everyone wants to see it over, possible. man. If you have seen The Simpsons, you know and love The Simpsons episode, Deep Space Homer. But this wasn't the only time The Simpsons went to outer space. In the season 27 episode, The Marge and Chronicles, Lisa signs up for a one-woman expedition to Mars as the company plans to colonize the planet. When Marge becomes upset at Lisa's decision, she decides to go along for the ride, only to have the trip delayed all the way to 2051, when it shows Marge and Lisa actually living on the planet. The Simpsons' great prediction seems like it will be happening pretty soon. Twenty fifty one. Actually, the one and only Elon Musk has his SpaceX wow. program, and Elon Musk says there are some major plans for the future. I think Elon starts been with a cargo Simpsons trip to lot, Mars man. in twenty twenty, then a citizen based trip around the moon in twenty twenty three. This will be followed with a human mission to Mars in twenty twenty four, the first of its kind. If it all goes to plan, anyway. Twenty twenty four. If the Mars test goes well, it can only be a matter years. of time well, before astronauts about start it. spending extended amounts of time on the planet for every advancement in clean green energy. On one episode of The Simpsons, Lisa enters an alternative energy derby. Her solar-powered car was unable to finish the race due to a blimp blocking out the sun. Well, 2020 is the year of major advancements and major hurdles companies must go through to get mainstream. It seems that some of these companies have used The Simpsons as inspiration. Okay, now let us know what Simpsons prediction will come true in 2020 and the years to come. It seems that it's obvious that their technology predictions will come true. Robots are already doing crazy things, yeah. so just imagine what they will be able to do in the future. If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Damn. Yo, honestly, that's a lot of things that is kind of scary about The Simpsons. When you really think about The Simpsons, a lot of the things actually did come true. Matt, it predicted that Donald Trump would become president. I and mean, he, he became the president. It also, there was also an episode I watched where Simpsons predicted that there's going to be, like, after 2021, January 2021, that there's going to be a major war because Donald Trump lost the presidency. So I'm kind of scared, man. It's it's really freaky how the Simpsons are like predicting all these things because that's just crazy. Like, is this guy really a, a time traveler, man? Is Matt really a time traveler? Let me know in the comments what you guys thought about that, man. Is he a time traveler? Is he not? I don't know, man. But it's just scary to think that Simpsons are getting all these things right, or just coincident. This is a big coincidence. Let me know in the comments down below. Anyways, man, you guys made it all in the video. You guys, know what to do. Get the video a big thumbs up. That helps me a lot. You guys, new to the channel because they didn't subscribe and they're not post notification bells on. And yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one.